Welcome to the Dog Advisory Council, a trusted resource for dog owners and enthusiasts. Today we will be talking about how fast can a Great Dane run. At the absolute fastest, a Great Dane is capable of running up to 30 miles per hour. They are the second fastest dog breed in the world, in fact, beaten only by the Greyhound, Whippet breed. Just because they are capable of running at that seemingly breakneck speed doesn't mean that they are just born that way. Just like any professional athlete capable of maximizing their body's limitation, a Great Dane must be trained to reach that top speed. Great Danes are more than capable of running long distances. Technically, Great Danes are not exactly your typical long-distance running dogs. That is, they're not exactly great candidates for a doggy cross-country team. Their ability to run long distances is simply because of their sheer size. They can cover a lot of ground in a short time, because their legs are long and this gives them an impressive stride. All things aside, Great Danes aren't any better than standard breeds such as Golden Retrievers when it comes to running distance or endurance. They rank higher just because they are so much bigger. Their incredible ability to run is what made them so popular throughout history. Used as hunting dogs to help hunt those large wild animals such as boars and bears, their speed and distance helped humans capture these animals that were so much larger and faster than them. Great Danes are large dogs and this helps them to cover more ground in fewer strides, that's why they are able to run so fast. That being said, they also have impressively long legs. In terms of proportions, Great Danes are well known for these knobby, thing, and gang legs that often look hilarious as your dog grows into them. These legs allow for longer strides, naturally. Another breed-specific aspect you'll notice is that they are also bred exclusively to be fast. They are aerodynamic and relatively thin, muscled, and agile dogs. All of these details make them faster and than most dogs as well. All in all, from size to proportions, and specific traits to the Great Dane breed, these dogs are certainly amongst the fastest and best runners around. If you're interested in seeing what your dog can do when he is trained properly, you'll want to be ready with the right training tips and supplies to make the most out of it. Here are the key concepts to focus on to help training stay on track, healthy, and safe. Consistent schedule. Since you now know that Great Danes are particularly stubborn, you'll need to put together and enforce a consistent schedule for the actual training itself. Your schedule should be, well, scheduled to start out slow and then increase throughout its window. Try to keep your consistency on the timing of the training as much as the actual sessions themselves. That is, if you normally train him on Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays from 3 to 4 p.m., try to keep that as consistent as possible. Not only will he often look forward to bonding and running with you, but he'll also know to expect it. This can make working with this stubborn and opinionated breed much easier all around. Right Diet Just like humans, you'll also need to get him on the right diet to help fuel his body, and give him both the physical energy, and the capacity to gain more muscle mass as he trains and gets stronger with your guidance. You'll need to focus on a healthy diet. You'll also want to focus on healthy, top-quality dog food as well. Keep in mind that a Great Dane eats about 10 and 12 cups a day, so you may find that the cost of the food does add up in a hurry. To keep his health top of mind, you will also want to source this food exclusively from his vet to ensure that he's getting all of the right health sources of low protein and vitamins and minerals he'll need to keep him strong and healthy while training. Prioritize bone health. Either through just the right food alone, through supplements that are vet-approved and prescribed, or some combination of details, you also have to really prioritize your Great Dane's bone health. Since you know that they tend to have brittle bones, to begin with, being as proactive to those potential issues, helps strengthen them preemptively and also jeeps the risk down during the intense training that you're giving him. Be careful with the training pace. Once your dog adjusts to training, you may find that he loves it so much, he's eager to go further than you had allowed in a certain session. Since Great Danes are loving and kind towards their favorite humans, they enjoy it for quality time spent with you as much as the actual running and training itself. But, this is where you have to be a responsible pet parent before a dog trainer. Since Great Danes are so prone to issues with their joints and bones, you have to be very careful and gradual with your pacing. If you only planned on having him run 3 miles in that sessions, that is your end goal. Even if you know he wants to run more, cap it there. 
With this in mind, you'll want to make sure that you are using the right training plan too. You can find all sorts of Great Dane training plans for running, but make sure that your vet signs off on the one that you go with. Not only can they determine a bad one from a good one, but they'll also take into consideration whether it's a good plan for your dog or not. After all, there is no one-size-fits-all for training, and this includes your dog. If you want to learn more about the training and how to take care of a Great Danes while training, click the link in the description below. If the information in this video was useful, please like it and don't forget to subscribe.